All right, in this video, I have two uh, baseball boom boxes and then one football boom box. Uh, I feel like I've had better luck on baseball than anything, at least with one elite box in the past. The second one didn't do so good, but the first one I got like five autos on, which was absolutely nuts, the most I've ever gotten out of a boom box. Figured I'd do um, baseball versus football, two to one. Football boxes just didn't really look that appealing to me this time. They just had sets that I'd, I wasn't really interested in, but this one I was like, okay, let's check this one out. So. This one comes with a sterling box, which is fun because those have an auto in every box, I believe. Yeah, the mini box has every box. I, I did a, a video on sterling actually already. Uh, oh, look at this, the magnet card holder's different. I'm gonna empty this real quick. But uh, this is for the platinum box. I'll take a buck 40 or something like that. And then I'll do the next one after this, but there's sterling there. Magnetic holders, they use a different one. That's cool. A little different than the, the normal ones we've seen. Oh, look at that. You got a silver pack, too. That's cool. Um, so, looks like you got a... Wow, they got a couple of extra things, I think, here. Wait, wait, wait. There's Chrome Hobby. And that's where the silver pack comes in. That's awesome, because I literally bought an entire box of this to get one of these. And I got one now with this. These things can be absolutely massive, but they're really hard to hit. Then, wow, what did they all throw in here? They threw in so many things. This is crazy. So that was one and two. Gold label to 21. One and seven odds. I've never opened that one. That one sounds fun. And then Bowman Hobby. I love that one too. And this is 2021. 20, uh, tough odds. One auto in a box. It's not the Jumbo box. It's a base. And then you also have a chrome and then archives and then also the platinum anniversary and i've opened one of these and i did a case break of that so i'm kind of familiar with those ones let's go ahead and start opening uh then we can do the sterling which has the uh the actual hit in it but we figured we'd go ahead and go head to head with one football box and just see which is better um but yeah if you guys like the video drop a like and then if you guys want to sign up for your own boom boxes link in the description it'll take you over and you can go do that. It's like just an affiliate link. I've never actually, I don't think I've gotten any dollars from it, from referring people, but, um, but you know, it's just an easy way to, to sign up if you guys are interested in it. There's a Kevin Smith, Pujols, Bell, three homers for Lindor, Luis and TJ. Not this most exciting pack, but you know, we do have the, this one, the Platinum Anniversary. I opened a hobby and then the hybrid or whatever of this was actually pretty fun too it's a pretty fun box and they do have autos in here as well on cards and stuff so just a couple dudes here not an eventful pack but still odds are difficult on single packs like those also shout out to my daughter she's four she did my nails for me i didn't have the option she was crying if i didn't let her so I was like, yeah, yeah, of course, let's do it. Goldschmidt, there's Trout. And then we got the, the Brandon Davis Summer Camp. Kind of a cool looking card there. And so let me move this one, I guess, over one here. What year was that? I'll put the Trout here because I don't have that one. And then Goldschmidt's kind of a cool one too. Anyway, then we get into the four that we... Or the three that we really got. And then plus I can't believe we got the Silver Pack. This is super epic. I really like, like Bowman. Oh, and so much fun to rip. Um, the jumbo packs have the three autos in them. The single autos come out of, or there's one auto uh, in the other one. Oh, there's a nice Alec Baum there. And the silver, and then Austin. Is this a previous, this is 2021. That's why it looked different to me, because I've opened a bunch of 2022. Um, and there we go. So Baum's nice, I'll take that. Probably not worth a ton because they printed a lot of these things but um nice quality cards i really this is my favorite quality card this like Bum, Bum and chrome whatever this is like this is kind of the same stuff that merlin's printed on super nice quality i wonder what that bomb actually is going for now that i'm just mentioning i'll look up center stage and see and that's a one dollar for the chrome so yeah not like a high dollar card but cool looking rookie um anyway We'll keep it rolling. This is the gold label. One in seven odds for an auto. Never opened this one before, but looks interesting. And 
Dude on the cover would be cool. This is heavy. Whoa, what is this? It's heavy. Do they have... It's gold. It's gold. What is going on here? Oh, there's a Atani. Nice. And him down here. And then what is this? Yo. There's a Vaughn Coldplay. Well, look at that. This quality is crazy. What in the world am I looking at? It's a framed gold auto. <laughs> this is nuts. Yemen. Mercedes, the White Sox, on card. Dude, that is crazy. I need to look up this product. Obviously, it's a pretty crazy one. I don't know how to, I don't know what to do with it because it's like, it's in a gold frame. Like, I'm going to have to figure out what um, to store that in. That one looks like it is $7. It doesn't show the frame. Oh, there's the one with the, no, that one's framed. It's like five dollars. How is that only five dollars? It's such a cool on card auto. I get and this one's um that's a good player. Why is it only seven dollars? That's really weird. Somebody explain to me why the pricing isn't higher on that. It's really cool on card auto. Uh anyway, one auto down, I guess, and then we do have the silver, this, and then the sterling which will have an auto as well. Um Chrome is pretty fun to open though. The hobby boxes are under two, so I was like, oh, we got gold. What in the world is that? There's Bomb again. All right. We have Burger. And who's this? Pitcher. Jack. True gold. 250. Yeah, centering's off. Little bits to the left and right is off. But Jack. Did I say Jake? Jack. More gold action, dude. The gold is bringing me the gold buck over here. Crazy. I'll take it. I don't know if that guy... Let's see if he's any good. I'm assuming he's okay, but not like... I don't know pitchers very well. And... It's like... $7? $5? $1? I don't know what it is. A couple bucks. We'll take it. We'll take it. Excited to even have an opportunity one of these, dude. So for those that didn't know, the Chrome Hobby Boxes, um, they left out the short print, like, rookie parallels or something something like that in the boxes, which is crazy. So Tops had the idea of creating these silver packs and sending them out and then giving those out instead. I don't know. It's kind of crazy. But there's a Machado. Oh, wait. There's two cards here. Bang, bang. And then there, there's a Contreras. If that's how you say his name. Wilson and Machado. Nice. That's a cool card. I don't know if that's... The centering's terrible, but it's a cool card. I don't know if it's worth anything. I'll have to take a look. I like both of those. I'll take a look at those in a second. Still got a lot to, to get through, though, so let's go and do that. Um, yeah, I don't know anything about... So sometimes, like, Tops has image variations, just like Panini, and I can never tell which is, like, in a variation or not. Uh, but that, that Mercedes card is so crazy. What a fun gold label thing. So this is Sterling. You get one auto in a, a mini pack. And you get five uh, boxes like that in a in a hobby box. Super cool, man. Uh, looks like no frills here. This is James Wood. Nice. And then Stewart. Nick. And then Hernandez for the Cubs. No craziness there Ryan and dude there um no numbered auto here but on card autos are so fun to get I don't know it's like hitting a it's like going to Vegas and then hitting uh like a dollar slot and then and you're getting a bonus game that's the way it feels like when you hit the on card autos it just feels nice to actually get an on card versus not you know what I mean so Let's see what that guy is. Let's see if he pulls it up. That one to 150 is going for like 12 bucks, so. And that one's listed at 25. Maybe he's okay. I don't really know, but he is somebody now that I it's like once I get like the cards, I get something uh you know I'll be a little bit more invested in the players, which is the fun part of the hobby, right? You're going to become more invested as you go. So this one comes with another 
Oh, this is a museum. So the museum's the same thing. It comes with an auto automatically. That's why I mean, at least you have the chance in this this one to get something big. And there's another magnetic card holder. I don't even know what the packs are in football this year or this month, to be honest. Oops, but we got two autos already. We'll take it, man. And a gold frame to boot. All right, what do we have here? So this is the um, museum right here, Bowman Chrome. Again, what year is that? Chrome 19, whoa. There's a sapphire. Sapphire is crazy. 19 chrome. 20 chrome. 21, well, there's 19 chrome, 20 chrome. 22, this is an extra one. Bowman's best here. And then these three are extra crazy. So then it goes Bowman Chrome 19, Tops Chrome Sapphire, Chrome Hobby, Bowman's Best, Chrome Hobby, Chrome Hobby. Here, like that. Sorry, get my ears wrong. I'm trying to figure out what order to, to open everything. And then museum, and then these ones will go first. So that's cool, man. I love that they give extra packs. It just increases the the odds just a little bit more in your favor if you can so love to see it seems like the best value at least for this month is these boxes um especially with museum and and the other one just because you get guaranteed auto which is kind of awesome to be honest if you know how it feels to get enough l's like myself it's kind of nice to get a w and some autos, and we got two in the in the lower tiered box. So here's Chrome 2015. Holy moly! I would not recognize a top rookie here, Tony. And then we got Blake. All right, 2022. I've opened a lot of this one. I just had a lot of fun opening a lot of retail on this one. Yeah, and there's so many rookies on this one. It's crazy. First, and then you get the crumbs on the back here. There was Tatis, and then we got Taylor and Sal on that one. I guess we'll put them all here. Put them all there. And then we have Bowman's Best. I'm not really sure what the odds are here, but there's a whole bunch of stuff that you can get back here. My nails are so distracting to me right now. I'm gonna have to take some acetate to clean them off, but my daughter's gonna wanna have me do my nails again. There's a uh, bomb again, man, nice. It's a bomb box. Put that mojo out and then the bombs will follow. Dominguez and then Frank in the back here. I don't know if that's a little, is that a silvery back? I can't tell if it's silver. Dominguez feature, it's probably not a very expensive card, but a fun one nonetheless. Then we got another bomb. Uh, rookie here, base, nothing crazy, but you know, sometimes you just gotta go like that. Bowman Chrome 2020, let's go for it. Obviously, we want numbers or autos. Numbered parallels are always a plus. Nick, and then we have that dude. We have uh, that dude. I know that guy's good, but I don't know if that card's any good. Kind of an interesting one. And then we have these little interesting looking cards here. Nothing too crazy on this. No, that's weird. Well, the, the borders are kind of interesting. All right, Sapphire. I like this one. This one's another one that's pretty crazy. You can get a nice auto out of Sapphire. Um, one in eight odds of a hit here. Oh, look at the, the cards look so good, man. I've opened a couple of the Sapphire boxes. They're, they're crazy. And Dustin and no rookies. That's a bummer. But they look really good, let's just say. For that. So we'll keep it keep it like that. We'll put all these ones together here for the Bowman Best. Alright, 2019. This is going fast. And then we'll get into football. 2019. And this is one in six odds of hitting something. Will I get one? There's Bart. Ooh, look at that. Israel. 
And that's a first, too. Look at that auto. There's a Kyle Tucker as well. Rookie. Bregman. There's a little Tucker there. Dude. I needed this guy to hit a home run for me the other day, and it didn't happen. I was kind of bummed. Um, all right. Maybe I'll put him here. And then this one's crazy. So I, uh, I don't know if it's worth anything, because I don't know the player so well but anytime i mean if you look at the <laughs> the pictures that guy's throwing a ball that guy has a catcher's mitt or you know a mitt and this guy's has a bat. so there's a chance that he'll probably be better but i don't know if he's actually good to be 100 percent honest i'm not overly familiar with him it's from 19 so that's six six dollars so that's a numbered one mine i don't think is numbered and it is a chrome though only a couple bucks. That's a bummer. I don't know if this guy ever made it. Maybe that's why I don't recognize him. Because it's a little bit older. But still cool to hit an on-card auto, man. And look at those guys' autos, man. They're they're signing it with all their heart. Love to see it. And they made their way into the, the house and into the room. So I got three autos so far. And then this one will be my fourth from this museum collection. I actually haven't opened any of this before as well. But it looks like it's kind of similar to... Sterling, where's the back right here? Lots of randomness here. Five trading cards. And this little pack. It's a box and a pack. A pack and a box and a pack. Let's we'll see what we get here. Hopefully it's something good. Five cards. Justin. These things are thick. There's Cal. And then... Oh, there's a numbered thing there. The doll. And then we got numbered patch. But then is this an auto? Canvas collection. What is that? That's not an auto. This is a... Uh, whoa. What are the odds of a canvas collection? That's crazy. Let's double check that. So we got two little hits there. And then the rookie uh, right here. But what is that canvas collection? Let's dig deep and see. If I can even find it on here. Canvas collection. Reprint. One and four. Bro, is this an artist proof or not? This is horse crapola. There's no uh there's no auto in here. And I think that this is just a junk insert. Bro. Clifton? You son of a gun. George Brett. Whoa, look at that judge 101. Some of those are crazy, but how do you know which one you got? I don't even know how to tell. Anyway. Reprint. Reproduction card from Museum Collection. Original artwork. By Angel. I don't know. I don't know anything about this. It's not numbered, so I'm assuming it's just a regular reprint, which does not mean anything super fancy, but still kind of cool uh, to get something different that I don't know about. Now I have to do some research and figure out what I'm looking at, because I wish it wasn't a reprint, you know, I wish it was like an original sketch, that would be rad. Then we did also get this little sneaky guy, Fernandez. Two, it's a, like such a thin card to have a, a patch in there, too. Oops, I gotta cut the edge. And we got the football one to do still, so maybe we'll get something decent over there. Fun stuff on this side. Not a lot of numbers, though. Not a lot of color. Uh, we got one gold, and we got one to 50 here, the materials, and then this weird little canvasy guy. But fun nonetheless. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess I can check these ones out, too. I apologize for the long delays, but, you know, we're kind of exploring together. What do we get? The doll. $2 of the doll. And Hernandez, $4 Hernandez. That's what we're working with. $2 doll, $4 Hernandez. What about gold guy, Jack? Gold Jack. Gold foil. Like a couple dollars. All right. You know what? It's, it's all fun and games until you realize that all of your fancy cards are not worth anything. But um, the thing is, is it still, it really is all fun and games. So I'm not even mad. I'm happy uh, that I'm able to open them and 
try my luck at trying to get something big, chasing something big, but really just having fun uh, ripping stuff and especially prospecting the baseball guys. It's kind of fun to see uh, what they have coming down the pipes. So anyway, let's check and see what we have here. This is the box that I decided to go with, even though I don't know. Oh, there's another one there, Legacy. And this is the, oh yeah, this is the Platinum. I didn't even do the Elite one this month. I, I just was like, uh, some of the stuff I wasn't really feeling. So there's Prism, No Huddle. That's partly the reason why I did this one, because I like Prism, No Huddle. Where are you, sneaky guy? Prism. And then two Certifieds, so interesting. One's a Thick Boy, one's not. So they, they gave me a thick one. That's kind of nice. Elite, I love that. Dunruss, I like that one. Prestige Extra. And then Legacy Extra. So two extra packs is always a plus. And we'll go ahead and rip these open and then recap what we got. But let's go ahead and put two of these out here because I feel like we're going to need at least two. Let's do three. We're doing three. Hopefully we'll get a couple hits out here on the side. So we'll start off with Legacy. I did a hobby box or two of these on my channel. Already, low tier, a hobby product. Fun. New year. Rookies in college jerseys, though, don't really do a lot for people. So, kind of what we're up against here. And there's Legends. Eddie. And who do we have here? Rookie, Danny Gray. Rookie, Pierce. One numbered card, Mr. Lockett here. And then we got Decade Dominance Warren Sap for the insert. We had to $2.99. Tyler Lockett. Tyler Lockett, numbered card. All right, nothing too crazy there, but we'll keep it rolling and see what we get. So, Prestige, they throw these ones in every now and then. I'm sure you could hit something big, but I've opened a couple. I don't really know the product super well, so, and especially since it's older, 14. But, um, Let's see what we got. Smith. Oh, look at that. That's awesome looking. Adrian Peterson. It's a shield. We got an NFL shield. Bang. Um, just kidding. Oops. Ryan. And the Colts. But that's uh that's interesting. I'm wondering. I wonder what that thing is. This is like an acetate like insert. It's not numbered. Don't know if it's anything like a case hit. I've never seen one of these in any of the packs I've opened, but that doesn't mean anything. I haven't opened that many packs. Cool looking card. Let me check it real quick and see what center stage says so we can have an idea of what we're looking at. No, it doesn't like it that way. So let's try again this way. It doesn't like it at all. Dude, I hate it when it does that. It's a cool looking card. I don't know. I'll put it up there just for fun uh, because of how incredibly awesome it looks. Don Russ, there's always backwards cards in here. They always freak me out every time. One of the times, so like the bottom, bottom was like ripped open. Um, the, uh, the last time it was because I saw a name right here that was a really good one uh, for the year. And then it was that really good player, but it was not the really good card. <laughs> that I was looking for. It was uh, Herbert. But there's a Favre here, and there's that right there. I don't know what's happening right here. I can't turn this guy around. There's a Favre, no helmet, and that is the card that is there. There's a Mike Parsons, nice. And then we did get a no-name, Bills, Sanders, and then also the, uh, what is here? Lawrence Taylor and... This dude, this guy's actually really good too. The champ is here. Oh, this is like one of those things. You can enter the thing. Crazy. I don't know. Anyway, uh, this, one, this one's kind of cool. I know these ones, I didn't realize what they were at first, but it's like a kind of a short printy sort of thing where they have like no-name versions of the players and stuff. So that's kind of kind of cool. Not worth a lot, but pretty cool still. Um, and I'll take a, take a look in a second. I got Parsons here again. This guy's fun to be able to collect. And I'll put him in my sleeve and throw him right here. That is that pack. Hopefully Elite brings us an auto. Give us a, an on-card. Feels real light though, honestly. 
How many cards are supposed to be here? Five? It feels like not five, but maybe. Maybe five. Give me an... Oh, um, no, there's five. Oh, what is that? What is that? Henry. James. What is that? Defensive Player of the Year? That is cool. I've never seen that one. Oh, it's numbered in 99. Fun. Gibson and then Kamara. So this TJ Watt is pretty cool. Defensive player in the year in like this goldy uh, sort of wave. And let's see. The 66 to 99. That's pretty awesome. Not a high dollar card again, but so cool. But then certified. There's two of these that I know nothing about. I honestly don't know much about this one. This is a thin one. And then I'll show you the thick board. Hopefully I get a patch or something. Or an, R or an RPA or something like that on the other one. Would you guys correct me on last time? We were like, RPA is a rookie. You did not get a rookie. Certified Stars, Tom Brady with a ding on the upper corner. Probably not worth anything, but we'll check. Miles and Claypool and Kid Reporter. Um, certified Star, I mean, it's Tom freaking Brady. Certified Star. Worth one dollar. Wait, wait, what was that one? 75. Anyway, Tom Brady. It's Tom Brady. Throw him right there. All right, next one. Please don't be a spacer. Please don't be a spacer. Like, you, you kind of know it's probably a spacer. Oh, no, it's not a spacer. It's actually a card. Look at that. I see it's, it's yellow, so could it be a, a picket? We got Coop on the back. Kind of interesting looking car. It's not terrible. Car and Fields, second year. Certified Stars, Burrow to 249. Now we're talking. And then what do we have here, dude? Oh, George. The wrong, the wrong one. Got a, an RPA, Freshman Fabric. Steelers, I saw Pickens. Not for many. Dude, that's crazy. We got one, something, though. That's cool. Nice to hit. Fields, nice to see in a second year. Cup. And then we did get a Burrow here. This guy's the one that everybody loves to hate. It's like, oh, Burrow's back. And then the next week, he, he throws a bunch of interceptions or something. And everybody's like, oh, Burrow's terrible. Terrible Burrow. Anyway, I don't know what to put this one in. It's such a thick boy. I don't have a thing right over here. It's a little bit dinged up up here as you can see maybe that's a bummer but still pretty cool and numbered to 299 so not a huge numbered card but dude we got a hit i'll take it and i'm gonna raw dog him right here uh but yeah i wish it was the other pickings that would have been crazy uh although you know the that that qb's kenny stepped it up earlier than he probably should have and um i don't know Probably not exceeding expectations. Looks like a basic little B back here for the no huddle. Fred Warner. That's how we're going to end it off of a Fred Warner. Uh, anyway, that is all of the packs. Got four autos, though. Three of them from baseball. And then at least we did get something on this side. I don't know what that George Pickens is worth. Probably not a lot because it's the wrong Pickens. Let's see if it picks it up and sees. Okay not helping center stage not helping at all look at these things dude too many things in the way bruh it's not that hard center stage okay so it is there's Emmanuel Sanders no name it doesn't have hmm I'm probably worth a couple bucks just cause it's the no name version or whatever and then I'm going to pull Georgie boy over to this side and see as well. Maybe I can see what this one is. Just because I'm curious. Oops. Keep knocking my camera. I cannot tell. It's not really picking them up. It's not picking them up, but I do have that one too, which is hilarious that I picked that one up. Anyway, Juju, wrong guy. Pretty cool, nonetheless. And 
two color patch on there as well not for many game blah 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 this one's kind of cool i don't know anything about it but i like that it, it's a little acetate no name joe over there and then on this side we did get a couple little hits as well this one's crazy right here so start off real simple with an a-bomb and then we got the jack as well tops chrome to 50 gold and then this dude the first i wish i uh, hopefully he was like really good or something i don't know it didn't seem like any of these guys are like top tier obviously uh, but it was okay it's fun to get some uh some autos and this one's super crazy this uh, gold label is, is wild the gold frame ah i'm gonna break it and then I did get a couple other random things. I don't know what this one is. I need to research that. But it says congratulations, like I got something special. It shouldn't say that if it's not special. Uh, and then you got this 24 of 50. It says congratulations again, meaningful material. It doesn't say not from any game or event. Oh, you guys are killing me. Um, all right, and then a couple other things. Kyle Tucker, Jaren, oops. A bomb, Dominguez, and I don't know about that one or this one. I gotta check them just to triple check, and then that one, probably nothing as well. And then from the football side, those cards back there, and then I got a number to 299 here. And then the Watt is 299, and then the Burrow is to 249. So those ones right there as well. So kind of the way the cookie crumbles, it doesn't always crumble in our favor, but we have fun with it nonetheless. There's a Brady. No numbers, Parsons, and a couple other random cards here. As you can see, the champ right there, Favre, and company. But anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, check back if you guys would like to see other rips, all personals on the channel. I don't really sell anything or anything like that. I just open stuff and have fun. But have a good one. Hopefully, we'll see you back on the channel for tomorrow. All right. Peace, guys.